Hey guys, what is up? So I was on Steam and I wasn't going to buy any more games because I've already spent way too much money on the Steam sale. And then I saw this, the Stanley Parable. I was like, oh my god. It's like, um, oh, what's that book called? I have that around here somewhere. Um, um, I can't find it. Um, by Mark Janielski. About the, it's a book. What is it? It's a book about a movie. About a book about the movie. And the movie might be fictional. It's very, what is that called? I want to say it's the house. Don't remember what it's called, but it's a really awesome book. Anyways, so this reminded me of that, and oh my god, it's like a mirror. Look, here's my mouse here, and then it's over in the screen too, and then there's a little one, and a little one. Oh my god. Okay, anyway, so I thought this looked really cool, so I bought it. I broke my own rule of buying no more games, but whatever. So, I'm going to play this, we'll see how it goes. Oops, I forgot to set my alarm. As soon as I set my alarm, we're going to begin the game, and um, oh, I have to turn down my volume. Some coffee earlier. Alright, so we're going to play for about 20 minutes, um, and then we'll see how this goes. I need a haircut. I'm actually going to dye my hair later. That's cool. Okay, so options. Um, I'm just going to go with what they tell me right now. Video. I don't know what these things are. Audio. Oh, speaker configuration. I want headphones. Closed captioning. Subtitles only. Full captions. <sighs> We're going to go with full captions. For whatever reason, I can't hear it in my headphones. So we're going to change it back to the two speakers. Can't hear anything now. Oops, I just fudged up the noise. Okay, begin the game. End is never the end is never the end is... Oh my god. I hope you guys can hear this. Why would you like that job? I'd be like, nope, done, I'm out. But okay, if Stanley was happy, Stanley was happy. Good, go get your own mind. Sorry. Oh, I'm in control now. What if I don't want to step out of... How do I move? Oh, damn it, I need to change that. Okay, options. Keyboard slash mouse. Reverse mouse. Or... Net, net, edit keys. Move forward. Oh, key. I want to change that. It's not letting me change it. Oh my god, I don't like this. Oh, because I wasn't doing it right. Nope, don't do that. Figured it out, you guys. Okay, move forward to a arrow. Okay. And I can hit a curl button super close. Okay. Back. Back. Resume the game. Okay, now I can move like an hour. Can I touch things? No? Do I have to do what the voice says? What if I don't want to do what the voice says? Fuck you, voice. Uh, I didn't say that out loud. I should bleep that. 
I probably will forget to, so I apologize for my foul language. Okay. So I left my office. No, can't open that door. What do I do? Apocalypse. Or no, the um oh what's that thing? Dang it, I look like such an idiot because I'm trying to talk about a thing. I want to say Inception, but that's wrong. Okay. What's in here? That door, that door doesn't have a number on it. I'm making, I don't know what to do. All the doors have numbers on them. Um. Excuse me. Um, I want to say Inception, but that's not the right word. Oh, hi, coffee. The thing where people were going to get sucked up and go to heaven because they were all super holy and so they got to go there first. What is that thing called? I know it has a name. Ooh, that's a math thing. Maybe that's the meeting room. How do I get in there? Maybe I go through. Oh, that's my birthday! 416! I like the number 416 because it's my birthday. Do I need to like smash a door with a chair or something? I'm gonna go through the door on the right because screw you! No, I just wanted to annoy you. So, eh, what could it hurt? Let's just go this way. Ooh. Do I not get a soda? Nope, no soda for me. What about a coffee? A coffee. I need some coffee. Oh, now I want to do a Google search of what that thing is. Should I do it, or should I just say no? That looks like a creepy place to go. I want to go in here. <laughs> I feel really short standing by this desk. Like, I'm like eye level on it. Aren't you supposed to be taller so you can, like, be like... I guess not. Okay. Stanley is short, is what we're finding out. Oh, I can't go back through that way? Huh. What does that say? Caution, do not lie. If you are lying right now, stop. I'm sitting, so we're good. And if you're lying down right now, stack. Apparently that's really bad. Okay, so we went from one creepy room to a factory. So all Stanley did was sit on a computer desk and push buttons. And for whatever reason, this place has a whole bunch of boxes. Warning, do not jump from the cargo lift while it is in motion. It will cause death. Penalty for miss... <laughs> Penalty for jumping off the cargo lift. $5,000. Alright, so if you jump off this thing and then you die... We're going to charge you money because you're dead. What? Yes, you're annoying. Is he going to kill me now? Who, me? I'm a her. I mean, I don't personally know Stanley.
Is it Stanley's daughter or ex-wife or ex-lover or... Oh my god. I don't want to go in there. Look at that. It's so creepy. I don't like the dark. I don't want to. I'm going to die. If I die, will you please tell my friends and family that I love them and that they're awesome and that... Well, I can't tell my sister to take care of my cat. She has cats and my cat has like cat diseases but tell them all that I love them oh <sighs> okay I didn't just freak out nope this is creepy oh my good I'm gonna die am I dead Am I back where I started? Oh, that was mean. That's mean. That you're jerk and I really don't want to listen to you now. Oh my god. Jerk. I guess I did die. Good morning, employee 427. Press 3 on your keyboard. Sorry, I cracked my knuckles. Please press the key. You're a jerk. I don't like the narrator. You don't. I didn't choose this life. Please press C. What was that? 3, 8, C? Should be writing this down? I'm going to write it down. Jerk. Because you know what? You never know. Okay, go ahead. Um, uh -huh. today is three eight Z. Got it. Sorry. Please press P to watch TV. Oh. Please press F to spend time with the boys. <laughs> this game's kind of mean. <laughs> Please press 6 to prepare dinner. I don't want to. You're going to make the kitchen disappear. This is what I'm talking about. This is why it's like that. Dan, Danielski, Dan Wilson, whatever that guy's name is. This is how it's like that book. And that curtain is kind of freaking me out. Because the window's open and the curtain's moving. And then the shadow on the wall is moving. And I keep going, like, is there a person over there? Even though it's kind of impossible for a person to be over there. I'm like on the third floor of a townhouse. And I don't want to, but okay. Are you going to take the creepy mannequin lady away? I'd rather she went away than the kitchen. Please press X. Tell your wife you love her. I don't love her. She's a creepy mannequin lady. Okay. Where? I know it's on my bookshelf. Oh my 
sort of bookshelf. Who is cover? Do I see it? Oh, I'm throwing the nasty. Yeah, there it is. Okay, hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Oh, of course. Oh, that's what it's called. Sorry, I had like 30 other school books on top of it, and like 40 more in front of it. This book, House of Leaves by Mark Z. Dan Daniel Lusky, Daniel, I don't know how to say it. No. This book, this book, this game made me think of this book. Okay, sorry about that. Okay, press G to go, I don't want to go to sleep. Going to sleep sounds kind of like dying. Should I do it? Should I do it? I mean, I want to do it. Ha! Ha! Oh, that's my timer. I don't think I had set that timer. No, I accidentally set a different timer. Oops. Prize press 8 to question nothing. I don't know what the guy told me to do, so I'm not going to press the button because I like to question things. Make it go away. Oh my gosh, it's such an old school pencil sharpener. These things were loud and annoying. I'm not gonna do it. Go away. Me out. What's I gonna do if I don't do anything? Hmm. Do I have to? Okay, I give in. <laughs> well, I tried not to hit the button. Please die. Oh. Well, I guess we died. So I guess take two will be to... Oh. Music sounds creepy. Okay. We're going to listen to this guy this time and hope that we don't die, because I really don't want to die. Sorry, I suck at acting. My birthday! I love you, door. I want to be you. Okay, I don't actually want to be that door. Um. I'm going to go through the right door, and then I'm going to take the first left. Like he told me to, so I'm not going to go all the way down. Long. Ow. Dang it, I keep running into things. I like this game. I actually really like this room. It's way nicer than the rest of it. Like everything else out there is like yellow and fluorescent and nasty. And here it's like, ah, relax. See, like, look, that's all nasty and fluorescent, and this is all like relaxed. Harsh, light, gross floors, weird walls, soft light, blue floors. Okay, don't kill me this time. I want to hit that button. It's a big red button. You're never supposed to hit the big red button, but I want to hit the button. I should be doing this on Twitch, and then you guys could be telling me, okay, maybe I'll do this on Twitch, 
and you guys can be like, hit the big red button, or don't hit the big red button. Okay, this episode's over. I'm going to go do it on Twitch. Yay! Okay, um, anyways, I am eeny, meeny, miny, mo, catch a tiger by his toe. If he hollers, let him go. My mother told me to pick the very best one, and you are not it. Okay, sorry. Sorry, I'll hit you some other time, you wonderful big red button you. If only I was a doctor, then I could have a Sonic and I could figure all this stuff out. I guess I go straight. Wait, why is that? Either that's to the outside world, or... Now that kind of hurts my eyes, I'm walking away. If I needed to sneeze, that would be nice. Meeting room, floor 4XX. What? Cabal planning? I don't... I don't think I want to know. Marketing Mondays, Termination to Termination Tuesday, we're broke Wednesdays. Pranking floors meeting. <laughs> what? What to do about 432? Don't tell 422 about my meeting. At least we have an office party. Do not alter without consulting whiteboard. There's a whiteboard manager. I want to be ripped. Oh, Rip, Franz. I'm sorry, Franz. Oh, shush you. I'm reading. Targets. Push for funding. Get Chris out of the broom closet. <laughs> I want to live in the broom closet. Not really. Not cost efficient. Standard graphs, 40x wide. Hire someone to synergize papers. Papers are too synergized. Fire a paper guy. Hire somebody to fire the paper synergizing guy. Who moved my desk? Please keep the targets on the topic of blah blah blah. Um, the future of yesterday. Tomorrow is now. Tomorrow. Complete today's unfinished agenda items. Right next day's agenda. Reflect. Okay. How to solve a dispute with a coworker. Let it ball up inside you. Take it out. Hey, I was reading that. <laughs> Using slides to assure employees that everything is okay. Make sure your side. Damn it. Everyone is unique. You, most of all. Except all these people kind of look the same. Just different stuff. Okay, I guess. Shush. Number of slides on the slide. Charts, charts and slides, slides. Next pie graph. Always required on a professional slideshow. Great at which chart on the same slide to pick the same information. Charts, numerals, ratios. Wow. Rate of increase in graphs per slide. Please, no more charts, please. I'm begging. Stop. The boss appreciation minute. On your boss appreciation minute worksheet, circle the top two. Funny things you love most about your boss. Fill out in triplicate and return. Okay, I'm done with this. It's moving too fast. Okay, moving on. Buy quarterly post for I okay. Those well, you may or may not have figured out. I like to read everything. I like to explore as much as I can. Um so if you get bored, I'm sorry. We need less reviews. 402 and 405 want to get rid of the death sport portion in the primary review schedule, but I think that's a stupid idea. More water coolers, more water cooler heaters. Charts need to be more hip to appeal to teenage demographic. Why are you giving charts to it? Like, I don't understand what this company is about. Like, they have huge warehouses of button of buttons, boxes. They hire people to push buttons. Maybe pushing the buttons is like, no. So I'm pretty sure it's, I don't I give up. Find teenagers to put in teenage demographic. Big net, some sort of child trap. Social media. There's your answer. Teenagers, uh, throw something in the idea bin. No more bins, trash cans. Renaming of the idea can. Fixing of me, idea bin. Okay. Great. Glad to know these guys have so much time on their hand. What do people want? Things, money, more money, things but with money to buy more things, graphs, graphs about things, and money. We have our new product. 
Okay, guys, we're going to sell graphs about money and things, and that's just going to be what we do. To do, synergize core value expenditures. Okay, I'm, I'm done. This place is weird. I'm out. See you. Broom closet. Oh my god, that door actually opened. Well, I guess Chris got out of the broom closet. I kind of want to touch things, but I'm afraid that door is going to close and lock me in. I don't believe you. Cannot believe you. I clicked. I touched things. Okay, yeah, we basically decided we're gonna go do what the voice says. Oh my god, those creepy, stupid curtain messing with the shadow right in front of me. Okay. Sorry, that it's creeping me out. Well, this is pretty. I could do something like this in Sims. Wow, now you know I play too much Sims. Um, is this really the boss's office? Like, damn. I want this office. Look at this. Huge ceilings. Billions of books. Booze. Lots of booze. Well, if it's extra secret, then don't tell me. Yeah. Let's go with luck. What newly opened passageway? There's a newly opened... Oh! Hey! How are you doing? That looks creepy and like something out of some serial killer show and like it will kill me. Maybe it's a supervillain lab. I could live with that over a serial killer. Um, creepy lights. It's over here. Creepy darkness. Oh, I get to push the red button. Bam. Yeah. Oh, I'm gonna die. See, that's the one thing I'm afraid of in an elevator. I am afraid that for whatever reason, the cord's gonna get cut, and I'm just gonna go. Push. Very not likely. So I'm not super afraid of that. But I'm just doing what another voice is telling me. That's my job to do. Oh. Okay, more creepy. More creepy. Okay. Um. Crap. We're gonna die. We are so gonna die. Okay. Escape. Let's go this way. Escape. Escape. I don't care. Escape. Blah. Blah. I can't see anything really now. Is that? Oh, that's weren't words. Run. Run for your life. Run for your life. I mean, yeah, it's getting creepier. Oh my god. What is? What is? I don't want to go that way. Run! That way? Yeah. Or should I go that way? Okay. Any, any, meeny, miny, mo, catch a tiger by the toe. If he hollers, let him go. My mother told me to pick. The very best one, and you are not it. Sorry, buddy, you're not it. <sighs> All the fun things aren't it, so we're just gonna go be boring and listen to the voice. I was gonna end the video a while ago because my alarm went off, but this is really fun. Um, yeah. Can I go up the ladder? Probably not. It kind of goes to nowhere.
Well, it's not even a ladder. It's a trolley. Okay. Whatever. Ugh. I mean, I don't actually know what I have to live for. Oh my god, it's like being back in Professor X's thing where he puts on the helmet and can see all the people. It really is. See, we're going to find a helmet and we're going to put it on and we're going to be like, and use our psychic powers and be like, it's every human in the world. And this is every mutant in the world, and we're going to kill them. Not really, but, um, I am not a nerd, because I know that. Also not a nerd, because I know about Doctor Who, and Star Trek, and Star Wars, and, yeah. Um, cameras. Oh my god. Holy crap, I was right. I don't want to go that way. Can I go back to escape? Freedom is... Uh, okay. A exit? Door? Numbers? Who is that? Is that 104? Yeah, 104 fired. Well, no shit, Sherlock, and oh my god, something terrible's gonna happen. Well, what's Stanley's number? 427? I'm gonna die. Well, clearly he did, because all he did was sit in a computer and push buttons. Offline. Offline. Well, that's kind of creepy. They're all offline. What am I going to do? Destroy it? Clearly the controls are already dismantled. Clearly. They're already dismantled, otherwise it would not be working right now. So everybody disappeared. Four. Click. No? Yes? No? Um, I kind of want to just jump off the edge because I don't want to walk down all the stairs. Can I go through the doors? No. Yeah. I knew I should have run out that escape door. Alright. Five. Nope. So four, five. Mind control idle in waiting input. This is a giant screen. It's like a movie theater screen, but way bigger. Like, if you're. I don't even know. Off or on? It's like big enough to sit in the, um, I'd say kingdom, but that thing was destroyed when I was a child. It's the, um, quest? Safeco. Safeco is the uh, baseball. Tacoma Domes down in Tacoma. Wow, I'm such a good Seattleite. I can totally remember where the Seahawks play. Today is not my day, y'all. Um, we're gonna say on. Click. Well, it's not about you, narrator. It's about 
me, I mean, Stanley. Yeah, it's about, it's about Stanley. Yeesh. Nuclear detonators wouldn't just eliminate the complex, it would like eliminate the world. I mean, um. One. I don't see a purple button. Air rank here. Do I have to go push two? Me to go. I can't go down. Where's the doctor when you need him? Holy crap. I love it. Okay, it wants three, which is a blue button. So we're going to press this one. Goodbye, employee 427. Okay. So this guy's a total ass. Let's go down there. Ow. So, I think I'm going to end this part here, and I may go play this on Twitch. Um, I think it may be more entertaining on Twitch. Also, I realize that my mouth probably is not matching up with my face. I accept that. The mic should not be repeating itself, and so I kind of don't want to fix the audio visual, yeah, audio-visual disconnect because I'm afraid it will go back to repeating, um, which I really don't want. So, I'll see if I can fix it without it repeating again. I love all these technical difficulties. Um, 
like, comment, subscribe. Um, I'll see y'all tomorrow and have a beautiful day.